And state leaders are focusing on a potential solution to Arizona's drought problems, water desalination. Yes, and that is where scientists, they take ocean water and remove all of the salt and minerals to make it drinkable. News 4 Tucson's Robbie Reynolds shows us the pros and cons, though, of the process. The Water Infrastructure Finance Authority of Arizona is looking into building a water desalination plant, but there are some obstacles in the way. The plant would be modeled after the Carlsbad desalination plant in San Diego County. The plant converts water from the Pacific Ocean, accounting for roughly 10% of the county's drinking water. WIFA has explored the idea of building a $5.5 billion desalination plant in Rocky Point, Mexico, with a pipeline to Arizona. But that's a long way from becoming reality. First off, the cost is immense, with the plant, pipeline, and management of the facility going well beyond that initial $5.5 billion construction cost. Plus, many in Arizona wonder if the cost and effort of starting the plant would actually be worth it in the long run. Building a desal plant during a water crisis is kind of like shopping when you're hungry. Uh, it's probably a bad idea. You don't want to build an ocean desal plant until you're sure that you have a market for that very expensive water. WIFA will wait to see what their budget looks like the next fiscal year before committing to any water solutions, whether they include a water desalination plant or not. Robbie Reynolds, News 4 Tucson.